Do you want to learn about the new tank that could change the rules of the battlefield? Imagine an armored vehicle that combines power and maneuverability, capable of breaking through difficult terrain, supporting soldiers on the front lines, and being so mobile that the enemy can't react in time. Meet the M10 Booker, a light tank that will soon become a vital part of the modern arsenal. This tank is designed to operate in places where regular armored vehicles might be too slow or too heavy. What makes it so special? Why are armies choosing it for their most challenging missions? Stay with us, and you'll discover the truth about a tank already being called the new secret weapon on the battlefield. Dive into the details of this story and see how the M10 Booker is redefining modern armored warfare. The M10 Booker was created to provide powerful fire support in places where other vehicles simply can't perform. Developed by General Dynamics Land Systems, GDLS, this light tank represents an innovative approach to mobility and firepower, bridging the gap between a tank and a support vehicle with a combination of maneuverability and protection. The Griffin Project, under which the M10 Booker was created, has its own history. Initially, engineers considered various weapon options, from a powerful 120mm cannon to lighter 105mm and 50mm systems. But the final choice was the 105mm M35 gun, which struck the best balance between firepower and mobility, allowing the Booker to combat various threats, from fortified positions to enemy troops. This cannon is capable of engaging armored targets and fortified positions at long distances, providing a significant advantage in combat. Moreover, the Booker is equipped with a robust stabilization system and digital sights, enabling precise targeting even on the move. For example, in dense urban or wooded areas, this tank can remain highly effective thanks to its ability to fire accurately while in motion. But what exactly makes the Booker so special? First and foremost, it's the lightness and agility. Weighing around 40 tons, it is significantly lighter than more massive combat tanks like the M1 Abrams, yet its armor provides excellent crew protection. In situations requiring swift movement across rough terrain, this lightness offers a substantial advantage. The M10 Booker stability and high off-road capability are achieved through its track and wheel drive, delivering excellent performance on rugged terrain and paved roads alike. For example, during trials, the tank demonstrated its ability to maneuver quickly even on challenging landscapes where other tanks might get stuck. On the battlefield, crew safety is paramount, and the designers paid special attention to this. The tank is equipped with advanced detection systems, enhanced situational awareness, and optimized armor coverage. The tank's front is designed to maintain a low profile, while side armor is reinforced, especially in areas where the vehicle may be vulnerable. The layout of the M10 Booker allows the crew to react quickly to threats. The driver sits in the front with a wide view through specialized periscopes, while the commander and loader are stationed in the turret equipped with the latest optical and sensor systems. For example, they can quickly detect an approaching threat and coordinate actions, even under intense stress. To combat infantry and low-flying targets, the M10 Booker is equipped with a coaxial 7.62mm M240B machine gun and a 12.7mm M2HB heavy machine gun, which is ideal for engaging aerial threats at low altitudes. These weapon systems give the Booker versatility, making it useful in a wide range of combat situations. The smoke grenade system installed on the tank plays an important role, allowing it to shield itself from enemy view. For example, when caught in an ambush, the crew can deploy a smoke screen to quickly retreat from the line of fire. The main sight on the Booker's 105mm gun is compatible with all standard NATO ammunition, making it adaptable and suited for international missions and joint operations with allies using similar armaments. This adaptability allows the military to quickly respond to new tasks and reduces dependency on specific types of ammunition. The M10 Booker is thus ideal for missions in hard-to-reach areas, such as mountainous and forested regions where heavier tanks might get stuck or lose effectiveness. It allows soldiers on the front line to feel confident that support will come when it's needed most. To draw a comparison, the M10 Booker is like the Army's light strike fist, capable of breaking through any defense while remaining stealthy, swift, and well protected. In a world where battles often occur in densely built up or varied terrain, such a tank is a true asset for the military. With its versatility and firepower, the M10 Booker is likely to become an indispensable element of the arsenal in the near future. Its ability to engage both ground and aerial targets makes it a versatile solution for the complex challenges of modern warfare. From 2024 to 2025, the first operational units with the Booker are scheduled to be deployed. 
These vehicles will likely be among the first sent to high-risk areas, performing tasks on the front lines and providing support where it's most needed. It's no surprise that experts are already calling the M10 Booker a true workhorse on the battlefield, as it can operate effectively day and night, under any weather conditions, and on any landscape. As the first Bookers are deployed, the Army will gain additional flexibility in operational planning, allowing tasks to be performed with minimal losses and maximum efficiency. Now you know why the M10 Booker is attracting so much attention and why this tank might become an essential part of the modern arsenal. Its unique combination of power and mobility makes it an exceptional choice for tough missions. If you're interested in learning more about the latest technology and combat equipment, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, give this video a like, and leave a comment sharing your thoughts on this incredible tank.